It's me again with update number two. These two guys. Um, I think I finally figured out a storyline with these guys. Um, I was kind of back and forth trying to figure out what to do. But, um, <laughs> hope nothing falls. Um, I think I'm going to go with what I originally planned when I ordered my um, Dolls Own Boy here. Um, and that is going to be, these two are clones, and this one here, the Zoom guy, he is the original. And his name, I believe, is going to be Ray, R-E-I. Um, and I picked Ray because, like, if you look up the word Reiki, the Ray in that means ghost or soul. And, um, yeah, so that's, like, a good designation for a clone, I think. So his name is Ray, this one here. So he's Ray and this other one who is a clone of him. It's a younger version of him. Um, and if I find a different wig, like a wavy gray wig like this for MSD size, I'll be able to, this, my doll's own role here can also be his younger self if I want to do a photo story like a prequel or something. Um, so I'm going to have to, yeah, I'm going to be on the lookout for one of those wigs. But I think they look pretty close enough in feature that they could be clones. I thought brothers first, but I do want to do the clone thing. But um, my row here will be named Psy in his second incarnation. And that's short for Psyche because... To make Ray here a viable specimen, they had to harvest organs at different stages of his development from other clones and use them to make sure he survived. And he's got, I'm not sure how many other clones parts in him. I want to say at least four. Like he's had two hearts and yeah, so he's kind of a mess. <laughs> But yeah, at each stage in his life, like his body aged faster than a normal human's would because he's a clone and uh, his organs just couldn't handle the, the strain. So they had to scramble and um, replace organs as they shut down. And in his current state now, he is blind because his eyesight finally failed. So... And there's no way to fix his blindness because at this point, the whole, um, what do you call it, experiment or whatever was shut down because the people behind it were trying to figure out a way to live longer. And yeah, so he was the experiment towards that. And then his little other self here, his clone, Psyche or Psy, um, he was designated as the brain replacement, and that was the only organ that did not shut down, so it did not need to be utilized. So by the time these two were found in the lab, um, yeah, Psy was already, well, he's, he's, um, how would you say it? He was put in suspended animation so he wouldn't age because they weren't sure at which point the brain was the most efficient. And they weren't sure how, as his years progressed, um, he would, um, Ray would turn out because they were sure, like, diseases like Alzheimer's and senility and stuff might kick in sooner. And they would need a younger brain to get around that whole factor but um yeah so he's kind of a mess he's got quite a few other people in him <laughs> although they're all his clones so can you really say that they're others that's just kind of yeah and then little Sai here who was put in suspended animation so he did not grow beyond this point and this was the age where everything started to shut down so he's like about 15 and Ray's about 20, 20 ish, 22. So, yeah, so he's still got a ways to go. But he has no, Psy here has no um, 
viable replacement parts. So when his time comes, there will not be any hearts or organs waiting for him. But Ray has made it past that point and has successfully um, integrated with his um, borrowed parts, <laughs> you could probably say. So there is no chance for, of him succumbing to death, but like I said, his eyes deteriorated and there's no fixing his blindness. So even though he is a perfect specimen, he is still flawed because he cannot see. And then the Psy here is in the prime of his life at this age, but he will slowly start to die. But yeah, <laughs> it's really depressing now that I've kind of laid it all out there. But um, but yeah, so the scientists that find these two, um, their goal is to try to make sure that they both survive however they can. But yeah, so that's that. But yeah, that's the kind of the story that was kicking around in my head. So that's kind of the bare bones version of it. But yeah, and I don't know, <laughs> like the thing that's bothering me is the fact that he's got the wavy hair and then his clone is straight hair. But I'm thinking that um, with the cloning process, like if it's done so many times, there are variations and um, mutations occur. So that's why he doesn't have, Sai here doesn't have the wavy hair. But yeah, so I don't know if that made sense at all, <laughs> but that's kind of where I was going when I ordered the, the Dalzone row here was he was a little lab specimen and then this guy showed up and I'm like, oh, they share kind of similar characteristics. Hopefully that'll work. So I'm hoping that's viable and they look close enough that they could be, if not related, or if not clones, at least somewhat related. So that's pretty much where I'm going with that one. But that's all I know for now. So that's my update with them. And I do have other um, updates, but I'm going to wait a while with that because, um, yeah. So I think I'll go for now and I hope you guys are having a good week and, um, yeah, <laughs> again, sorry that it's been so long since I made a video, but hopefully I'll be back in the swing of things. Um, if not now, then a little bit later in the month because I'm thinking, yeah work should start slowing down with winter, the onset of winter, and it's going to be cold. <laughs> it's already cold. I'm not used to this, but um, yeah. So like I said, hope you guys are having a good week and thank you for watching. As always, I'm very happy that you subscribed. I don't know why, because I'm crazy, but <laughs> I really appreciate it. And forgive my really crappy camera work. I still need to figure out how to do this decent. But anyway, um, yep, that's all I know. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs>